Welcome back guys. Sparring for the most part should be just for practicing and nothing else, right? But there are times when things get too heated, too intense, because one or both of the fighters started to throw too hard. Well, in today's video, we'll see cocky men who had the opportunity to spar with a professional and because they were so full of themselves, they did way too much, thinking that maybe they could surprise or shock the pro. But because they decided to try this, they got destroyed instead. Let's start with Raya Hall who thought he was just having a light sparring session with his gym buddy when this guy just because he was being filmed starts throwing a lot harder and that's when he connects with a really hard kick to the head. Well the partner thought that everything was fine because Hall shook his hand as if to say damn that kick was really good but let's just continue like nothing happened. But Hall he couldn't forget the lack of respect and he threw his patented spinning kick. The kick landed exactly on the liver and ended the session instantly. The guy in orange did lower the intensity a lot after he kicked him in the head, just wishing that Hall wouldn't get even. And since it took him a while to do so, the spinning back kick was even more painful. The one in white is the legend Sain Chai, and the one in black is a fool named Daniel. At least I think that's his name. And Sain Chai does these classes to teach beginners his style and techniques. But this little boy wanted to show that. Uh, I don't really know what he wanted to do because it's not a good idea to try and beat the teacher. Easy. The actual teacher for the class kept telling him that it's just a sparring session and to take it easy, but he didn't want to lower the intensity, so Sain Chai decided to lower it himself and began to throw harder to match him and maybe teach him a lesson. <laughs> what do you think is going to happen? That Sain Chai is going to see you and say, Damn guy, you're a freaking god. You want to become a professional? Come on, I'm going to give you a multi-million dollar contract. Nothing like that is ever going to happen. You're just going to make him angry and then he's just going to ignore you. Anderson Silva was sparring in what he thought was just a regular sparring session. But suddenly, the opponent started throwing real hard after Silva kind of embarrassed him a bit by throwing a flurry of punches. <laughs> Silva took a big right hand and that's why he threw the knee with a lot of power, but he wasn't even finished yet. Silva threw a lot of punches, but they were all soft, but the other guy started throwing much harder because he felt he had to prove something. Silva couldn't take it anymore and started throwing elbows without any protection. This is where a lot of people get mad at Silva. Elbows are not thrown in sparring without a lot of protection, but his anger drove him crazy. At least this challenger learned not to antagonize the professional. There are fighters who just because of their luck and attitude, they can scare anyone. And one of the most famous ones is without a doubt, Vanderlei Silva. Silva can win a fight during the face-off just by looking at his opponent. In 2011, he was sparring with another fighter named Michael Costa, who went pro but never had much success. Here Costa crossed the line, wanting to play tough against the legend. Silva eventually got tired of his shenanigans after he threw an axe kick at him and put a beating on him. At the beginning, the session was going very well and it was very technical, but when you start throwing kicks with power that can really hurt someone, that's when you make anyone angry. At least he didn't dare throw anything back when he was being beaten on the ground and he only took his punishment like a good little boy. Donald Cowboy Cerrone seems to be one of the nicest fighters in MMA, but in this video, he knocked out his teammate for no reason. Maybe he was having a bad day because this poor fellow didn't do anything wrong. He had the opportunity to fight a legend and he did everything right. He remained calm and showed him great respect. But Cerrone threw one of his magnificent combinations and he ended up putting him to sleep. At least he has a story that he can tell for the rest of his life. Hamza Chimaev is looking to have some big fights very soon, but in the meantime, he has been going really hard on his sparring partners, like this poor guy in Thailand. I couldn't figure out what happened before this moment, but Chimaev is quite the bully here, beating this poor guy who's not even throwing anything back. Hamzat also seems to be going very hard for what appears should be a light session. Or maybe 
Just maybe they paid this guy to just let himself be hit so they could upload it to the internet and say that Chimaev smashes his sparring partners. Here we have the well-named psycho named Sean Strickland destroying and putting on a show on his sparring partner for no reason. <laughs> This video was uploaded by Strickland himself, and he said that it was consensual, but this sparring partner didn't seem like he wanted to be there. You could see the entire time that he wanted the session to end, because while he was throwing some stuff gently, Strickland was striking as if he were fighting with Pereira, and then to end the sparring session in that fashion, he went way overboard. This starts out as a light sparring session between Conor McGregor and his sparring partner, but ends with McGregor landing a left hand that knocks out the opponent. Everything was going well, so I don't know why McGregor suddenly decided to step on the gas and threw such a hard punch, but the reaction was kind of weird from McGregor. I don't know if he wanted to apologize or he was kind of disappointed because the partner couldn't take anything. Here we have the classic example of a beginner fighter starting to believe in herself a bit too much because she is doing so well sparring with her teacher. This fighter was throwing hard and blocking very well. But almost every time, the moment comes where the teacher or the professional decides to get you off the cloud that you climbed on top of without any merit. And this teacher absolutely yanks her from that cloud with a brutal kick to the liver. Ooh. 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 Wow. Her body completely shut down and also her desire to believe in herself. That liver kick sounded like a good spanking. Montana Love is a professional boxer, and he was having a sparring session when the other guy apparently started disrespecting him. I'm not sure how, but they were talking a lot, and Will Love got heated. Well, the amateur did the right thing by not trying to respond like Love with anger, because then things would have gotten really bad. He also withstood the punches very well since he really didn't do a lot to defend himself, and even so, Love still couldn't knock him out. Montana Love crossed the line because he was clearly better, and there's no need to punish someone who does not know as much as you, but like I said, it's best not to anger a professional. Honestly, if I had the opportunity to spar with a professional, I would never think of trying something that would make them angry, because I know that they would destroy me in seconds. I would rather just appreciate the moment because this doesn't happen every day, and I would try to absorb everything I could since this is not gonna happen again. Thank you for reaching the end of this video, and if you want to see more of my videos, just click on the video that's on the screen right now. It's really good, I guarantee it.